Morning all, you're joining us on a freezing Friday morning at Red Clean. Um, we are going out today, me and Sean are going to go and see some of the, the cleaners. I, I see them every morning at the unit, but it's nice to actually go and see them uh, earning their money instead of just chatting away uh, at the unit in the morning. We, um, we've got a few different buildings to go and see today. We're at a commercial building at the minute. Um, a lot of people are asking us uh, why we clean windows still in the winter months. We're, we're off to go and catch up with some of the boys then. Uh, if you want to hear more, see more of, of our stuff, uh, get any more information on why you should have your windows cleaned in the winter, please hit subscribe, follow us, um, any comments you might have, leave them below and we'll speak to you soon. Right, so we're just on our way to meet our first window cleaner of the day, um, Stuart I believe. Yeah, uh, got Rory back in the driver's seat for this one. It's been a long time coming. It's been, I don't know, you've been out with something. I'm not quite sure what. I've just, I've been a, a very busy boy. Very busy. And uh, yeah, it must feel good to be back in front of the camera. Not really. No. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't That's mind. a typical it's nice, nice to get out of the office for a bit. Sure. Um, sometimes just don't, yeah, it's just too busy to allow me to come out. Right, um, yeah. But it's, yeah, it's nice to come out and catch up with the cleaners. Yeah, check on the lads. I'm going to talk about about kind of why it's good to clean your windows in the winter still. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. A lot a lot of people believe that it's seasonal, um, and, and it's not. Uh, there's there's a few reasons really why why it's, it's good to, to stay on top of the window cleaning in the winter. Yeah, and we'll sort of explore those those reasons why as we uh, go through the day and meet the various cleaners um, on this cold morning. The sun's low, the temperatures low, uh, but the window cleaners are still out there getting those windows done in the winter. So that's a frosty morning with Red Clean today. Um, we're just coming out onto a few of the jobs that some of the lads are out on today. Um, it's freezing. The guys are still working in the cold. We still work in the winter. Nothing really stops us. Um, we're going to go and see Stuart. Hello, Stuart. Hello, Rory. How are you doing? Good. What are you doing? Cleaning windows. <laughs> Why would you do such a thing in such in horrendous in weather? weather. <laughs> I know, it's horrible, isn't it? So why do we clean windows in the winter? So there, there's quite a few reasons, to be honest. Um, one of them being that the sun is at its lowest in the winter time. So any imperfections on your glass is going to show up more. You're going to get more dirt on your windows in the winter. Um, more dirt leads to, obviously, dirty windows. <laughs> You're not going to be able to see through them. Um, and, and it also lets the light penetrate your house, which can help reduce um, heating costs, uh, which obviously at this time of the year, we all know we'd like to save a couple of quid. Um, so yeah, the more sun you're getting in your house this time of the year, the better. Obviously, the more dirt this on your window is, is going to affect the sunlight coming through. Uh, it's, it's the perfect weather for algae to grow. Yeah, it, you want to get it removed. So yeah, we, we don't stop working in the winter. Uh, we carry on 360 days a year or something we work. Um, yeah, the windows don't clean themselves. And as I say, the, the sun is at its lowest. So for me, I notice my windows dirtier in the winter than I do in the summer. Um, so yeah, that along with a few other reasons that we'll, we'll uh, fill you in on during the course of the day. Right, so we're here at one of our commercial jobs that we do uh, in Milton Keynes, uh, Wed to Be. So we're going to catch up with Martin on the windows. Uh, one of the, the other benefits of, of having your windows cleaned in the winter is um, some people get sad in the winter. Uh, it's, it's actually a, a condition. Uh, people get depressed and down because of the dark and dreary days. Obviously having your windows cleaned can eliminate some of that problem as well. Um, a nice sunny house, nice bright house. Uh, it, the darkness affects people's mental health. Um, and yeah, that, that's, that's another, another good reason to get your windows cleaned in the winter. I'm not saying it's gonna save, <laughs> save you or, or cure mental health problems. But obviously the more light there is, the, the better you feel. And everybody knows we always feel better in the summer than we do in the winter. So let's go and catch up with Martin now and see if he's uh, helping people's mental health. <laughs> Keeping yourself nice and warm by scrubbing the windows as fast as you can. Yeah, I always found that the days seem to be quicker in the winter because you do work faster, don't you? Work faster to stay warm. Have you had any problems with windows freezing up? No, I was all right. Been all good because I had um, Steve's dad's office first. Oh, okay, and, uh, it's all inside, isn't it? So, yeah, yeah. Well, not, nice warm one to start with. 
Yeah, and I have to let my pipes defrost. Well, yeah, we used to have the problem in the winter when you're doing uh, domestic properties. Sometimes they won't have a heater or heat on in the conservatory. So as you're cleaning the windows with the pure water, it would just sheet up. Um, you just have a sheet of ice over the windows. So any, anywhere that's heated isn't usually a problem, but the conservatories can be. Uh, as we always point out to the customers, that it's pure water that's, that's frozen onto that window. So as the temperatures do thaw, that sheet will just slide down and take any dirt and debris with it. Uh, we've never had, I've always said to the customers that and, and if the clean comes out any different uh, to what it would do normally when it's not icy, call us and we, we'll go back and rectify it. We've never had a call back. Um, so that sheet of ice does just slide down. It does take away the dirt and, and it is still as effective on the windows. Sean today on a freezing day uh, to do a little bit on camera. I've done a little bit on camera and I'm now hiding back in my vehicle because it is freezing out there. So Sean, Sean's still out there getting some more footage. And I'm hiding away because I'm scared of the cold. I've been in the office now for about a year and a half, uh, maybe maybe getting on for two years um, and I've, I've climatized to, to, to the office. I don't like being out in the cold anymore, so I'm hiding. We're here at Stacey Bushes in Milton Kings now at yet another commercial property that we look after. Uh, we got Aaron down here today with Harry, uh, just cleaning up the shop windows. Uh, no matter what time of the year it is, we're, we're out working. Uh, obviously with shops, they, they want their windows looking good because it's, it's the curb appeal. The, the front of the building looks good. People come in and, and, and buy their chairs. Uh, that's why they keep using us. So it brings us back to the, the curb appeal on houses. Um, people stop a lot of people tend to stop in the winter having the windows cleaned but again it's, it's curb appeal you want your house to look good just like the shops want their shop entrances to look good and the only way to do that is to maintain your cleaning um, also as well it, it protects your windows uh, wind, wind dirt algae everything like that settles on your on your windows around your frames and seals it will disrupt the, the longevity of your windows um, they, they can rot lead to damp uh, the damp inside can then lead to black mold so if you want to protect your windows and you want to keep them lasting uh, as long as they should do, keep them clean. Let's go and see Aaron and Harry. Hi mate, how are you doing? Cold. Cold. Where's, where's Harry? <laughs> burger van. Burger van. So Harry's escaped and uh, run down to the burger van. I don't blame him. So Harry, <laughs> so we've come to see you working and found you've snuck off to a burger van. We've done it. <laughs> what, oh. what delicacies have you bought, Harry? None of your business. <laughs> this is my lunch break. Wait, Harry, there's no such thing as a lunch break. <laughs> How you doing? So we were like proper paps then, weren't we? Fuck. Jumps out from behind the vehicle. I noticed you in the corner of my eye. I was just like, hang on. Then you said something, I looked right over. Fuck. <laughs> so we, we, do, we do let the lads of Red Clean have lunch breaks as well. Some of them choose not to, some of them just crack on through the day to get done quicker. Uh, others like to stop and have something to eat. Obviously, that adds time onto the day for them. It's, it's the well, individual's we got till choice. Four so who cares? That's it, sun's out now as well. 
Sun's out, Harry's happy. You got your sun cream on, Harry. Fair hair, factor 500. Um, so yeah, we, we, we came to see the guys working, obviously we missed them working. Oh, so close. So we missed we're, us by about this one. That's alright. Let's go and get professionals on camera first. The best chips. I've just eaten a McDonald's breakfast, but I'll eat one. They are good chips. Proper country. They're like top diamond chips. Go on, Aaron, do it. Go on, Aaron. Oh, okay. Oh, I'll have Sean's one. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so that's a wrap. <laughs> All right, so that's us. Uh, that's our Friday visiting done for the day. And that's pretty much us wrapping up for the week as well now. Uh, we've got no vans out over the weekend. Let the lads have a break, thaw out, and prepare themselves for next Monday. So thanks for watching. Um, if you like what you see, Please click subscribe and you'll see plenty more footage coming from us soon. Take care.